this is how to adjust a DS5 inward opening door uh, on 2D hinges to uh, close the lock inside gap and make the door actually work. You can clearly see that the door does not close before height adjustment. The 2D hinge means that the door can be moved in two dimensions. The middle hinge being the adjustment for height to move it either up or down. As we can see from the door, it's too low. So we turn the screw to adjust the door up. After height adjustment, the door passes the sill and closes. After height adjustment, we need to be looking for a four to six mil gap down the locking edge of the door for the hooks to engage and the door to lock appropriately. This is a typical door handle that is not engaging fully when the hooks will not reach into the lock keeps. The top and bottom hinges on a 2D door hinge are the hinges what adjust to the lock side or the hinge side. They are different hinges to the middle hinge. This is showing adjusting the hinge to move it over more to the lock side. After adjusting the top hinge, we then repeat the process on the bottom hinge, moving the door towards the locking side to reduce the gap width. After adjusting the door over to the locking side, you can clearly see that has reduced the gap from 10 mil to four. Some people may find that when they've adjusted the door, the door mechanism is stiff. If this is the case, we need to adjust the keeps in the frame. The main effect of a door handle being stiff is the bounce in the keep and the door not locating properly, thus allowing the hooks to be tight. Adjusting the middle keep to locate the latch on the door so it sits in the frame correctly needs a T15 star drive and these two are eccentric cams so must not be turned fully all the way round or they will round off. Turn a quarter of a turn and then go to the opposite end. If you need any more, then repeat that process. After adjusting the middle keep, you can clearly see it's taken the bounce out of the door, which in turn then takes pressure off the hooks and allows the handle to lock. If this is not the case, then we need to go to the hook keeps and adjust there. Adjusting a hook keep is the same process as the centre keep, making sure you do not turn the T15 star drive cam more than a quarter of a turn at a time. This should allow the hooks to be freer, making the handle smoother to lock. After adjusting the hook keeps and the centre keep correctly, a smooth handle mechanism should make the door lock easily.